How do you find how many tiles there are without counting them one by one? In this lesson, you will learn how to count objects by using an array. Let's review what skip counting is because this will help you count quickly. Skip counting is counting by numbers other than one. Suppose we were counting chicken legs. Instead of counting each leg one at a time, we can count by twos because they are pairs. Counting by twos looks like this. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. There are twelve chicken legs in all. Skip counting is definitely a faster way to count. These tiles are going to be difficult to count because they are not in an orderly form. We can move them, though, into an orderly arrangement of rows and columns to help count them. They are now in a form called an array. What shape was made? A rectangle. This is called an array. An array is an arrangement of objects into rows and columns. These are the rows and each row has the same number of objects. In this array, there are three tiles in each row. These are the columns, and each column has the same number of objects. For this array, there are four tiles in each column. There are 12 tiles in all. Notice how every row and every column has a tile, and there are no empty spaces. But if you take one away, this cannot be called an array anymore. This array had 12 tiles to start, but when one disappeared, the amount of tiles became 11. No matter how many times you try, the number 11 can't be made into an array. Not all numbers can be made into an array. Now we can count the tiles one by one like this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. But there is a faster way to count now that they are in an, or in an array. We can use skip counting. If we see three tiles in this first row, then without counting, we know there are three tiles in each row because of how they are arranged. So skip count by threes. Three, six, nine, twelve. We can show what we just did by using what is called a repeated addition sentence. It is called this because the same number is repeated over and over again. There are three tiles in each row, so we can add 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3. Notice how there are four rows, so we need to add 3 four times. The total number of tiles is 12. In this lesson, you have learned how to count objects by using an array.